Oh my goodness, everyone. Welcome back. My name is Christine. This is Mr. Bangles, and that means you're watching Hobbit's Corner. How many of you actually said that as I was doing the intro? Thank you so much for stopping by the channel. It is Tuesday. Um, we're going to open this really cute Christmas sweater jewelry bag. Got a little bit of threading there. Um, this is the cutest little satchel. It is an actual Christmas sweater with a zipper in the back. We're going to open this and take a look and see what's inside today. Um, the other thing that I want to show you before we get started is we've been cleaning out, um, well I haven't, but my in-laws have been cleaning out some of the stuff in their house. And this was a parcel package that was in their home and uh, my husband brought it home. So I thought I would share with you some really cool brass medallions that uh, that have been collected over the years. They're Christmas medallions. So I think these were given out by a business. This says 1987. It has this beautiful bird with pears. Very like vintage Christmas themes. So that's a cute one. Here's another one of like a toy soldier. Doesn't necessarily look like a toy, more masculine. That's 10, 11, 12, I guess. And this is from 1998. Aren't these neat? These would be nice ornaments. I have another one from 1990. And this one has some really nice birds, some holly. Here is one from 1994. This one has a lady milking a cow. Five, six, seven, eight on this one. That's really interesting to me. It's very different straying from the theme we've, we've been seeing. This is 1989. There's some more birds the number three i wonder what these numbers are no idea i just thought they were really neat and i thought i'd share them with you there's another bird one this one has a number two happy holidays 1988 there's another one of someone playing the bagpipes Musical notes from 1997. Isn't that neat? We have one, we've got a few more in here. Here is another one with some holly, the number five. These almost look like Olympic circles. This is from 1991. I'm wondering if they gave these away to staff to commemorate. Here's another one with some swans, the number six, 1992. So yeah, that's all I have for these, but I just thought, what a neat thing to share with you. I don't know, do you have any of these? Have you ever seen these before? Sorry about the noise. Yeah, they are really cute though, aren't they? What a neat collection of, I think they're brass. Brass uh, ornaments, I guess. Yeah, so I thought I'd share that with you. <clears throat> and for those of you who've come for the jewelry, let's open this really cute Christmas sweater bag. It is chocked right full. Oh, can pull, let's pull this out. There we can see, we can get a look inside there. Let's take a look at what's in this little Ziploc. And we have cute little, is there another one in here? It is. 
These look like really cute little angels made of crystal. Those are pretty. Don't see any mark on them, but those are really cute. We have another pair here, some rose gold, with some pretty rhinestones. I don't know if those are, uh, I don't suspect that they're real. They're cute though, what a nice color of pearl. Oh, look at these. Oh, these are blingy. Are all the stones there? They are. Those are so pretty. My goodness. Love those. My favorite so far. The lightweight, too. It's another pair. This person liked to. Uh, the rhinestones, like me. Those are very cute. We have another pair. These look like long, like icicles almost, encrusted with rhinestones. Those are pretty. A little bit of wear here, but generally in good condition. It's a lot of cute earrings. Here's a ring. This looks like it's costume. It's got like uh, some leaf with some really sparkly cuts in there. I'm pretty sure it's... Hmm. I don't know what it's made out of. I don't see a mark anywhere, though. All right, let's keep going. Ooh, these are pretty. This is a beautiful toggle clasp with a key. It is missing one of its stones and another one there. Still really pretty. I really like toggle clasps. These are uh, glass pearls in the ivory white. With that really fashionable charm and toggle clasp. These are in really good condition, aside from some of the rhinestones, which we can replace. Here's another really pretty necklace. These are glass as well, and they're knotted, which is nice. Love the bead caps. That is so cute. Really cute choker. They feel really nice, nice and heavy. <clears throat> Here is a cute rhinestone kind of neutron looking bracelet. It's very, very flashy. It's cute, it's flexible, and it has all its rhinestones. That's really great. It's a good piece. Like the unique pattern. There's another this is rose color, rose gold. It's kind of articulated. Just has the nice little bar of rhinestones there. This person liked sparkly things. Here we go. We have a Roca Wear. I think this is a Shoppers Drug Mart uh, brand. That's a really pretty watch though, rose gold. It's in great condition. Really great. Here is a bracelet. I 
This has a little symbol on it here, which looks like a crown. I'm not sure, sure who makes that. It's a nice little uh, leather bracelet with gold tone. Looks like a Betsy Johnson. Just the style. But we'll have to look at what that little crown is. Well, we have a pair of little cute earrings, some resin inlay in there from Value Village. Here is a choker chain, the kind you would find at like Ardeen or Claire's. We have a rhinestone necklace missing one of its stones that's an easy fix though Very cute i've got this chain with some pendant pieces here acrylic chain is pretty though it's in pretty good condition it is not sticking to the magnet. It also has a little charm on it here. But I am not sure what that says. S something. Do you see that? No idea. It's interesting though that the chain is not sticking. Maybe it's gold filled or something. I don't know. Because there's like a connector here that isn't the same color. So someone repaired it. We'll have to uh, test that. It might be gold. Feels like it. I don't know though. It's still pretty. I would probably replace the end of this. Use the chain for something else. It's a crafting opportunity. There's a cute bracelet feels very hollow no mark on it I think this might be silver like a hollowed silver I'll have to check that that's really pretty though I like that oh what is this Look at this fanciness. It's got a great cross on it. Is that how you open it? Oh my goodness, look at that. That's pretty funky. There is no mark in it anywhere that I could see, but it is cool. What a great little bracelet. Look at the patterning. That's so cool. What a great piece. Lots of like modern pieces in here. What do we have here? This looks like a little pillbox, maybe. Oh, it's got a little medallion in it. it says Maria de Guadalupe, Santa Maria. Oh, it came off of something. It was in here. This is like a little pillbox. Isn't that cute? I like when we find non jewelry stuff. Oh, there's a dollar ninety nine tag. Ooh, got lots of stuff tangled up in here. Oh, what is this craziness? This looks like it is a fabric fabric necklace. Got some pretty colors in there. Different. I'm trying to get this one out because it was taking up so much space. So, oh, Mama Jama, this is like what we opened yesterday. Check this out. It's got suede tassels, some plastic rhinestones. This is pretty funky. It's got a really cool chain. 
That is really cool, like that matted silver. Love that chain. Not really too keen on the whole pendant piece, but it is kind of cool. I don't know about these suede things. Different. Still looking at it. <laughs> Still trying to figure it out. Here we have a black chain acrylic with some metal. Look at those colors. It's kind of funky. Different. We have a black single box chain. This is pretty too. Put a pendant on that. I always like finding chains. There's all kinds of stuff in here. They wanted $2 for this. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's broken. But I can fix it. This might be another one where I change up some of the stone colors. This is really cool. Just on a cord. I like that owl. Okay, what is this? What do we have here? going to come out. There we go. This is a necklace. They wanted $2.99 for this. It's got these really cool charms. It's got a suitcase. It says New York, the Eiffel Tower, and an airplane. This is like a traveling necklace. Someone who likes to travel. That's a really pretty it's in great condition. It's a cute little earring. This is neat. This is really pretty. Look at this. There's the clasp. Oh, I love this. Look at all this dyed stone. They're so pretty. I love this little chain in the center. What a great necklace. Oh, very, very nice. I love the red. Oh, we've got a another cool chain. It feels kind of lightweight. It's like just, you know, base metal of some sort. And then it comes down to this locket. <laughs> Video. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh my goodness, do you know these people? How many times, guys and girls, have I opened lockets and they have pictures of people in them? Like someone gave this away. Oh my goodness me. I wonder if their names are on the back. Okay, so if you know those people, tell them I have their locket. <laughs> Here is a cute. There's another one. It's like someone bought this stuff or I don't know. I don't even remember where I got this from to be honest. This looks like the bits that you put in horses mouths. It's attracted. But it's still a really cute piece. Made very well. So it's too funny. Here we have again $2.99. We have a cute charm bracelet. It looks like it's got some pewter on it. So let's take a look at what these charms are. We have a key, some hair. We have cute little boy and girl. Why is it so dark there? What are such? My shadow is making me irritated. Then we've got this cute little heart. And then another key, 
and then so it repeats itself but that's a really cute charm bracelet I like that got another neat necklace here there's some wear I see on this chain but the statement pieces are really cute Looks like we're missing a couple of um, colored pieces in the statement necklace right here, but uh, we could take those out and just, we could take, yeah, we could take some of these out and move them around or make them into something else, but it would have been really pretty in its day. It's plastic salvage and then we've got just a couple things left we have this let's make sure we've got this this uh, no there's something stuck in there everything is sticking to the inside of this and I think that's it yeah our cute little sweater is empty so there we do have a match for these earrings which is nice those are cute little dangly Hoop earrings. Oh my gosh, look at these. These are telephones and they're earrings. Those are so cute. Those are sweet. And it says Avon on the bottom. Check that out. So we've got, I don't know if you can see that. I got it upside down. Avon. Those are awesome. And the last thing, we've got a tag on it. Ooh, this is pretty. Let's see if we can get this off. So this is a really cute kind of rose leather, rose colored leather uh, bracelet. That really nice plastic stone there. Old tone. It's really nice all right this is a tough one there was lots of really cool stuff love these earrings like this like this love these earrings love these earrings really like this bracelet I think that's super cool um, what else oh this is really neat like a lot of really uh, funky um, bracelets in this and cuffs right what else do we have uh, I like this too. This little bracelet here. I think this watch is pretty cool. Um, what else did I like? Yes, we can't forget you. I really like this red styled necklace. I'm trying to move this stuff out of the way. I also like this um, touristy, travel-y necklace here. That's cool. I don't know why my camera is like, it does not like me today. Um, and I really like, to be honest, I really like these this pearl set. It's very pretty too. Uh, I don't normally like pearls, but those are pretty cool. So yeah, some pretty cool pieces in this uh, this lot as well. Remember um, to like, comment, and subscribe. I really appreciate, uh, you know, the fact that you spend time here watching these videos. It means a lot to me. And I love sharing uh, the love I have of jewelry with everyone else. But you all know that. So thanks so much, everybody. Until next time, take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.